Libra, welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your weekly general message for November the 9th through November the 15th. And of course, we are starting with the Love Bird bonus for those of you who are in a beautiful, beautiful romantic bond. All right, angels, what's going on with Libra? Angels and guides, positive energy for the lovebirds. Yes, yes, yes. Positive energy for the lovebirds. Hmm. Angels, what's going on for Libra? Hmm. Lovebirds, what's going on for those of you who are in a beautiful, beautiful romantic bond? Yes, you have soulmates and Keep going. The world at times is big and loud, but we'll make sure you're safe and sound. Yes, you are with your beautiful, beautiful soulmate. And I feel like they're protecting you this week. I feel like your soulmate is protecting you this week from the world that's so loud and so big and so crazy. Yes, so you may lean on your love this week. All right, let's get right into the singles. The singles, love energy, positive energy. The come on angels, what's going on with, you know what, there we go, there we go. We have, for the singles, we have, <laughs> Let's get, let's, let's keep shuffling for the, and there we go. You know what? We're going, we're going to um, just use both of these. We have the divine masculine, could also be the divine feminine, wherever you're sitting, um, with animal healing and backpack. So I feel like this week when it comes to love, yeah, you're kind of dreaming about that perfect soulmate union and then this person is perfect but perfect for you perfect for you animal healing no matter the creature earth sky or sea animals show us how true love can be true love yes 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 backpack get your compass adventure is yours get out of the city and enjoy the outdoors so i feel like this week you you know I feel like there is, I feel like there's some energy around you this week, and I feel like it's true love. It's, um, and I feel like you know exactly who this is. Maybe there's going to be some changes this week, maybe even some travel with this person, or you're thinking about traveling with this person. Libra, I know you know who it is. I know you know. <laughs> All right, so let's move on to the general message for Libra for seven little days. Angels and guys, positive energy for Libra. Angels, what's going on with Libra? Positive energy, please, with Libra. And let's go ahead and add, yes, my mama's deck for Libra. Angels, Thank you. Oh, let's let's keep shuffling. Let's just keep shuffling here. You're like, okay. You're like, okay, stop shuffling. Stop shuffling. All right, there we go. Positive energy for, <clears throat> for Libra. Angels, what's going on for Libra? And let's add the, I feel like, you know, let's add the dragon's deck shall we let's add the dragon's deck for libra mm -hmm, mm -hmm. thank you thank you thank you and of course we want the dragon's deck up right side up because we want all the goodness all the wholesomeness out of the cards <laughs> yes and yes all right now let's go ahead and top this off libra mm -hmm. with the hummingbird deck angels positive energy we're looking for goodness yes we're looking for joy for we're looking for joy for libra angels and guides positive energy for libra 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 oops oops okay so and thank you thank you and thank you all right so libra let's tidy up a bit shall we and we will get right into your message yes yes and and yes, okay, so major theme of the week is the king, is the king of wands reversed with the five of spades, the jack of clubs, moderation, seven of hearts, and the six of diamonds. So the king of wands reversed, it's telling me you're taking a look 
at everything. Oh, you're looking under rocks, you're looking under paper, you're looking through books. You're taking a look at everything this week. Not that you're looking for something. You're not necessarily looking for something. You're just looking at everything, okay, with me because I feel like there's changes that will be made with the Jack of Clubs. I feel like this is some, um, I feel like this is some youthful energy, but take it slow. Maybe in the past, maybe Libra um, with the Jack of Clubs, maybe there was some elements of, of um, your personality or maybe there were some elements of someone in your world that maybe wasn't so honest, right? Or, or maybe it was you that weren't honest, right? But with the moderation, I feel like feel like take it I just get the I just get take it slow take it slow with the seven of hearts it feels like um, there's some some hurt feelings and and I feel like with the six of diamonds it feels like these hurt feelings it just seems to like go on and on but you know I feel like no matter what you're looking at everything you're looking at every change that happened and I feel like this change had to do with someone that maybe wasn't very honest with you. But I don't see you like, like you wanna know, I feel like you wanna know the truth. I feel like you'd wanna know the truth. I actually see you um, looking into things, like maybe looking at someone's social media, maybe looking at someone's text messages or, or something of that nature, but you're not doing it like all at one time. It's like you're taking your time. Okay, maybe today I'll take a look at this. Maybe today I'll take a look at that. Because it's almost like you just, you just don't, there's a party that, part of you that really does not want to know, but you know with the Six of Diamonds, um, it's almost like you gotta know, you gotta know, right? So I'm gonna leave that like that and let's get into the recent past. In the recent past, you have the Queen of Cups with the Queen of Diamonds, the Six of Diamonds with the Realign, the Ace of Diamonds and the Seven of Clubs. So in the recent past, I feel like, I feel like Libra, things were going, you know, emotionally you were pretty okay, kind of laid back, but there was something that was agitating you a bit that felt like that agitation just kept going and going and going, and you had to readjust, right, and start anew and get positive about whatever that was. Now, in the middle of the week, Libra, we have the Two of Cups reversed with the Queen of Clubs, the Two of Clubs, the release, the Queen of Diamonds, and the Nine of Clubs. So I feel like <clears throat> there is love around you, Libra, but it's not exactly where you would like it to be. I feel like I feel like there's things that need to be taken care of. There's, you gotta do this and you gotta do that. You gotta do this. With the two of clubs, I definitely see you having a conversation about this. I feel like there's something that you're going to release. And it looks like with the queen of diamonds, it looks like you're releasing a bit of agitation. I don't know why you're agitated. Maybe because things aren't uh, right side up, if you know what I mean. With the Nine of Clubs, I see you either talking about it or you're talking about releasing the agitation for the way, where it's almost like things, things are not the way you would like them to be. And that's agitating you, right? And I see you wanting to have a conversation about that. But I see you releasing it. I, I definitely see you releasing it. I see you talking about releasing that agitation, okay? And I'm just going to leave it like that, okay? No, when we look at the end of the week, you have the three of cups with the eight of clubs and the timing card with the five of diamonds and the four of clubs. So by the end of the week, I definitely see things are a lot better. The energy is a lot higher and you're having fun. With the eight of clubs, I feel like yes. And you're like, mm -hmm, I'm having, I'm having, be fun but everything is in the right timing things definitely will change and you know it will change because you're changing up here okay now almost like the joy is coming because you're changing 
your mind about a situation. Now, <clears throat> when we look at your bonus, you have the three of wands with the nine of swords reversed, the four of spades, the nine of diamonds, consistent, jack of hearts, and the ten of hearts. So I feel like, I feel like there is there is emotional worry. There's this, this worry is up here. It's affecting up here. It's affecting here. It might have even been a third party situation, but you're starting to get over it. You're definitely getting over it. You know, and you're going to make sure it's a lot of work to get over this, letting this go, but you will, you definitely will let this go. Is it a sacrifice? Absolutely. But can you do it? Yes, you can with the 10 of hearts because there's so many people around you that love you and adore you and they want to help you release this energy. So yes, it's going to be an amazing week because you already know what's on. It's almost like, it's almost like, you know, you know what's been bugging you. You just know what's been bugging you and you're working on, you're literally doing the, the, the work. You're, you're getting control up here to get control down here. And there's a lot of people around you this week that are willing to help you through that. Okay, friends and family. So I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.